Hi, my name's Carol McRae, and I thought I might talk to you today about our Reiki workshops. Now, I've been doing Reiki since 1998, and I've been a master since 1999. And during that time, I've taught hundreds of people how to, how to do a Reiki treatment on themselves and on others. Now, if you've never heard of Reiki, um, be mindful that when you get the calling, you will find that you'll hear about it everywhere. You might find it'll pop up on social media, or you'll have a chat with somebody, and they'll just mention that they've had some Reiki. And um, I also run a busy practice downtown in downtown Dubbo. I'm a clinical and five path hypnotherapist. I've been a Reiki master, as I said, for more than 20 years, a Seishem Egyptian healing master. I've done theta healing training. I've done uh, touch for health kinesiology. I've done kinetic shift, um, Seishem, uh, as I mentioned, and all sorts of different healing modalities. And I, before I, I did any of that, I was a nurse and I also ran fitness centers for 20 years. So I've had a lot of years working with people, helping them to improve their lives. And Reiki has just been a profound thing that's changed my life forever. Initially, um, I was teaching fitness centers and at the end of uh, working in that industry for many, many years, um, I had some injuries with my knees. I had chondromalacia patella, iliotibial band syndrome, inflamed fat pads and patella tendonitis. And the surgeon said there was a 20% chance of fixing my knees. And of course, I, um, I left that business and I went up to Camp Eden. Um, and when I came back, I'd already made the decision that since the surgeon said there was a 20% chance they could fix, them, fix my knees and forget it, you will, won't, you'll never exercise again, you can't even go for walks. I then decided I was going to have to learn how to heal myself. So I was in a bookshop and a book fell out of uh, the, the shelf in front of me and it was on Reiki and I read the back and it actually, um, it just reminded me of what I'd uh, read in a book that I was recommended at this workshop five years before in Jupiter's Casino in, um, in Queensland. And when I read the back of that book, I went, oh my gosh, this is what I've got to do. And so I then got a magazine. I went off to Byron Bay and did my training. And when I came back, even though my knees had been swollen for more than three years and I had tendonitis in every joint in my body for the last year, I came home and I put my hands on my knees for 20 minutes. And I got up the next day and the swelling and the pain was gone. And in that moment, I remember going, oh my God, this is not my imagination, this is real. And from that moment on, I started um, I started doing Reiki treatments. Three weeks after I did the training, I was doing treatments. A year later, I did my master's training. From then, I've been teaching hundreds and hundreds of students how to do Reiki because it changed my life so profoundly. And um, I've worked with people with simple things like a headache and you know, getting rid of it in three minutes or whatever, all the way up to uh, one of the ladies who used to do my yoga classes had um, non-Hodgkin's lymphoma and a football-sized mass in her stomach, and they, they told her they didn't think she was going to live, and I started doing Reiki on her. And although she had chemo, um, she because I did the Reiki treatment a day before or the day after her chemo, she did not lose her hair, she did not have a day of sickness, and three months later, she was cancer-free. I've even cured my own bone cancer that I had with Reiki. And so I just know it, it's just, it changes lives. And these workshops that, that we run are really about self-empowerment. So it's not just about learning how to, how to channel life force energy. So Reiki is a Japanese form of hands-on healing. And what we're really doing is in, those, in the workshops, you are being attuned so that you're like this hollow channel that draws that energy through you. The first level or Reiki level one um, has four attunements so that you are brought into vibrational frequency resonance with the Reiki energy. And basically you become a channel for that energy. So it flows through you and into that person. They're really just drawing what they need for the healing. It's not you sending, but that client draws it through you and you become that hollow reed, that, that facilitator, so to speak.
So with Reiki level one, the, there are four attunements, but you will learn all the hand positions. You will learn about chakras and auras. You'll learn how to feel the aura and see the aura. You will learn all sorts of metaphysical information about how the different parts of the body are really like a, a roadmap to the soul so that we can work out the causes of some of those illnesses or injuries. And that way we can start to reprogram the mind as well. However, the Reiki energy has an intelligence of its own and it will do that work. And with level one, uh, you will also uh, learn how to do a treatment on yourself, learn how to do a treatment on other people, and you'll be able to use that Reiki energy to just empower everything that you do in your life. It, I promise you it will change your life forever. And as I little look, look down my little list, um, Reiki um, treats the symptoms uh, as well as the causes, not just the symptoms. And it will work on the mental, physical, emotional, and spiritual level. And it is absolutely amazing. It, it will enhance your spiritual awareness, of course, and just connect you more deeply to that divine source that, that flows through everything that, that we have. And um, with level one, you'll also get your own comprehensive manual and you'll get your certificate, but you will have lots of practical experience to, to really feel confident in what you're doing. Level two is the next level. You can't do level two until you've done level one, of course, but with level two, it will increase that amount of energy that it flows through your, your energy channels. And it will also give you the symbols that um, Master Mikao Asui, the founder, discovered on Mount Karama as he meditated for 21 days. And those symbols are number one, to increase the power. The second symbol is about learning how to do mental emotional healing so that you can really connect more deeply with the causes and clear them energetically. And the third symbol is about distance healing so that we can send energy across time and space. And I know that sounds a little weird, but it is just like magic, I promise you. So the master level is all about learning how to become, well, how to be able to teach that and pass on achievements to teach other people how they can, they can also do Reiki and connect them to that Reiki energy. So level one has four achievements, level two has uh, two attunements, the master level has one attunement and you don't have to do any more than level one if, you've, if you're drawn to do it, but I can promise you once you've done level one, you will probably get the hunger to do level two as well. So when I'm doing a Reiki treatment on someone, the way I explain Reiki is that when we've got mental and emotional issues going on in our life, it'll cause a block in the flow of our energy field or our aura. Now, if we're not able to deal with those emotions, that energy block will move in through the layers to manifest as illness or injury on the body. And when we do Reiki, we're just pumping energy back into the field. And that energy um, that goes into the field will clear any blockages that will speed up the healing process. Um, firstly, energetically, then um, it will also work on the mental and emotional and the physical levels. So I can promise you, it will just amaze you how effective it can be. Um, one example would be, I had a gentleman came in who um, had been on oxycodone for a bad back for 18 months and he was actually addicted to, to that oxycodone and he was told um, that it may take 18 months if he was ever able to come off. And six weeks before he came and saw me, he'd had spinal fusion and he was in a lot of pain. And we did one Reiki treatment on him. He sat up and he said, oh my God, the pain's gone. And I said to him, you know, what I've read is four sessions in a row will fix anything, but I don't, very rarely do I have a client that needs any more than one or two sessions. And he said, no, book me in because I've got to get off this medication because my wife's threatening to leave me because I've been so addicted to it and she's giving me the medication. So um, he came back the following week and he said, I've had no pain since I saw you. And um, he said it went three days and then I went into spasm and I knew it was the addiction from the, the oxycodone. So I said, well, let's just go with the plan. By the time we'd done the fourth session, which was three weeks from start to finish, he had no more pain and he was off all his medications and the addiction was gone. And um, six months later, when he came and saw me, he brought his mother in and, and she had arthritis in every joint in her body, but I didn't recognize him because he'd lost 35 kilos and he was back working as a security guard at the hospital. Now, when his mother came in, she said, well, I don't really know what you've done with my son, but I know it's worked and I'm willing to give you a try and I don't believe in it. And I said, that's okay, jump up on my Reiki bed and here's my Reiki bed over there. 
And so she hopped up on the, on the Reiki table and I did a Reiki treatment on her. And when she sat up, she said, oh my goodness, am I supposed to have pins and needles in every joint in my body? And I said to her, look, all I know is you draw what you need for your own healing. And if that's what you've got, it's probably what you're meant to get. So about two months later, I ran into this beautiful lady in the street and she came up and hugged me and she said, I don't know what you did with your magic hands, but I've had no pain since. And this is the mystery and the magic of Reiki. And um, it, w it will change your life forever. It's been one of the, the foundation things that has really transported my life. And not only have I been able to heal my own body, but I've been able to heal my em emotional traumas that I've had throughout my own life. And just to start to see my whole life differently. So I really see there are no obstacles in life. Everything is about the opportunity and the learning. And it's an opportunity to grow our soul and connect with our truth that we are all in fact spiritual beings having human experiences rather than human beings that have spiritual experiences from time to time. So I hope this information has been useful for you. I will put a link um, below or above this post so that you'll be able to follow to my website or to my, um, my Reiki events on Facebook. And as I said, we've got some workshops coming up very soon, a level one and a level two. And later on in the year, there will be a master's level as well. Um, and if you find that you're drawn to it, if you find you're interested, please click one of the links. You can read more information about our workshops or just ring me and uh, my number is 0413346637 and I'll pop that link down below uh, as well, my phone number. Or you could just check my website, which is just carolmccrae.com and feel free to text me or phone me or message me with any questions and um, I'm always happy to help. So thank you very much for your time. I hope this has been informative and I hope to see you soon at one of our Reiki healing workshops that will transform your life forever. Namaste, my friends. Have a beautiful day.